After working really hard to make money in dollars, receiving your payment should also not be stressful, even if you are right here in Nigeria. And I think when it's time to convert your money to Naira, you deserve to get the best possible exchange rate. Most people just use Payoneer and then withdraw from Payoneer directly to their Nigerian bank account. But that's not exactly what you want to do if you want to get your money at a really good rate. So in this video, I'll show you the process you can easily follow to withdraw your US dollars from Payoneer, Upwork, and Fiverr to your Nigerian bank account through a platform that will give you the best value for your money. The platform we are going to use to do this is called Clever Banking. Clever is going to serve as a bridge between wherever you need to receive dollar payments from and your Nigerian bank account. Let's say if you're a freelancer, and you need to receive dollar payments from your clients abroad or from platforms like Upwork or Fiverr or even from a platform like Amazon KDP. With Clever, you can create a verified US dollar account within minutes and get all the account details you need instantly. Also, it is completely free to set up your account and they don't require you to pay any fees to get your USD account details. If you don't have a Clever account yet, just click the first link in the description of this video to create a brand new account. The sign up process is very easy and I've made a detailed video covering how to create and verify your Clever account and how to receive your USD account details. I will also link that video in the description below so you can check it out if you need a guide on how to set up your Clever account. But basically, if you follow the link I mentioned in the description, it will bring you over to the sign up page. Here you can just enter your first name, last name. The country is Nigeria because currently Clever is only available to Nigerians and then enter your email address, phone number, set a password for yourself and then you will see my referral code here automatically. But if it does not show up, you can just type it in manually. The referral code is simply ima 21 and then how did you hear about Clever? You can just go ahead and select YouTube since you are watching this video on YouTube right now and then check this if you want to receive email newsletters from Clever and then also check the terms of service and privacy policy and then go ahead and click on create account. Once you sign up and complete the verification process, your account will be reviewed and approved, and then you can proceed to get your USD account details. Now, I already have a Clever account, so I'll just go ahead and log into my account. After your account has been verified, you can come over here to your dashboard and then go to accounts to get your USD account details. Now, if I click on account details, here you can see that my account has all the details I need to receive payments either through ACH or domestic wire transfer. So this is the account name, the bank, the account number, routing number, SWIFT code, account type, and also the address. And you can basically use this account anywhere you need to receive dollar payment. So right now, I'm going to show you how to use this account to withdraw your money from Peonia, Upwork, and Fiverr. So let me log into my Peonia account. To connect your Clever account to your Peonia account, just come over to bank account and at the top right here, you can see add account. So just go ahead and click on it. For the bank account type, select personal. Then bank country here, you want to use United States and then select bank account currency. I'm going to select USD and then click on next. All right, so this is where you are going to add your account details. For the bank name, the bank name here is Wells Fargo. So just come over and select Wells Fargo. And then the account holder name, I can just copy and paste the account holder name. Then the account number, I can copy that as well. This is the account number. Copy and then come over, paste it right here. Then routing number, copy that also. This is the routing number, copy and then come over and paste. And finally, the account type, you can see here, the account type is business checking. So I'll just come over and select checking account. Then check, I confirm the bank account details above and then click on next. Now I need to confirm my Pioneer account details. So I'll need to enter my date of birth, then the password and then click on add bank account. All right, bank account has been added successfully. Account approval usually takes up to 30 minutes. So while Pioneer is still reviewing these account details, let me show you how to also add your Clever account to your Upwork account so you can withdraw directly from Upwork to your Clever account. So let me open Upwork. On your Upwork dashboard, click on Profile Settings and then come over to Get Paid. Then you just want to come down here to Withdrawal Methods and then click on Add a Method. And as you can see, there are a number of withdrawal methods that you can use, including direct withdrawal to your Nigerian bank account. 
but I will not recommend you use this because aside from considering the fact that you will likely get a lower exchange rate from your bank, Upwork will also charge you for every withdrawal. So what you want to do is come over to direct to US bank account. And you can see this withdrawal method is actually free. So you can just go ahead and click on setup. So the account holder name has to match your name on Upwork. That's why you need to make sure that you enter the right details when setting up your Clever account. Then the next thing is the account type. You just want to select checking. And then the next field is for routing number. So I'll just copy the routing number right here and then paste. Also get the account number, just copy this and then come over here and paste. And then we need to confirm the account number. So I'll need to type that in manually. All right, now everything is in place. But you can see here that this payment method will become active in three days. And that's why usually you want to do all of this, set up your withdrawal method even before the time you want to withdraw so that you will not experience any delay when you want to collect your money. But right now, I'll just go ahead and click on add bank account, enter my password, and then click continue. So you can see that my account has been added and it didn't even take up to three days for it to become active. I think it happened instantly. And this account is now active and I can start with going directly to my Clever account. The final platform I want to show you is Fiverr. So let me open Fiverr. Here, the first thing I'm going to do is switch to selling and then come over to my business, then earnings and then click on manage payout methods. For Fiverr, you cannot use direct bank deposits if you're in Nigeria. And that's because the withdrawal method available for you on Fiverr is based on your location. So what you need to do is to connect to Payoneer, and then whenever you receive the money to your Payoneer account, you can then withdraw it to your Clever account, since your Clever account is already linked to your Payoneer account. So here I'm going to click on add payout method, and then let's verify it's you. I'm going to use verify by SMS, enter the verification code, and then click submit code. All right, now click add payout method. So you can see there are just three payout options for me here, Pioneer, and then bank transfer, which will also happen through Pioneer, and then PayPal. And then they said available payout methods are based on your account location. So I'm going to select Pioneer account, and then the currency is still USD, and then click continue. Here, go ahead and click on got it. Then go ahead and open your email. You are going to see this email from Fiverr asking you to confirm your Pioneer account. So I'll just click continue. If you don't have a Pioneer account, it will walk you through the steps of creating a new one, but I already have a Pioneer account. So I'm going to click here where it says already have a Pioneer account. And that is done. You successfully submitted your Pioneer application. You get an email as soon as it is approved. So now anytime you make money on Fiverr, you can just withdraw it to your Pioneer. And then from Pioneer, you can easily withdraw it to your Clever account. Right now, let's go back to Pioneer. Let me show you practically how to withdraw from Pioneer to Clever. So I'll come over here. Let me close all of these other tabs since we are not using them right now. So I'll need to log into my account again. And you can see that our Clever USD account is now active. That means we can start withdrawing to this account. And then one thing I like to do, let me just give it a nickname. That makes it easier for me recognize which account I'm going to. So I'm going to click on save. Now let's go back to the home page. I have about 60 US dollars that I want to withdraw. So I can just come over to withdraw and transfer and then click on withdraw to bank and then select the account I want to withdraw from, which is the USD balance. And then the account I'll be withdrawing to. For this, I'm going to withdraw to my Clever account. So select the Clever account. And then the amount you want to withdraw, I'm going to use $63. And the amount that will be sent is $61.74. That's after Pioneer has removed their charges. So the charge is $1.26. So after all of that, I'll just go ahead and click on review. Here's a summary of the transaction. I'll just go ahead and click on withdraw. Enter the OTP. And then I'll also check don't ask for a code whenever I'm withdrawing to Clever. So that anytime I want to make withdraw to my Clever account. I'll not need to enter any OTP. Then I'll just go ahead and click Submit. So that is done. Your funds are on the way. Usually, dollar transfers take at least one business day to arrive at the destination. So I'm going to wait for the money to enter my Clever account. 
then I'll show you how to withdraw from Clever to your Nigerian bank account. Okay guys, the money has arrived in my Clever account. And you can see right now I have $60.45. It actually came in earlier than I expected. We've come back to accounts. You can see the transaction here. It came in by 4.30 a.m. this morning. And you can see the amount that was sent is $61.74. And the deposit fee is $1.5, which is normal for every ACH transaction. So I got $60.24. Now to withdraw from your Clever account, to your Nigerian bank account, you are going to notice that the current exchange rate is at 1,465 Naira for $1. And this is one thing I love about Clever. You always get the current market rate because there are some channels that will give you yesterday's rate or they have a fixed rate for the week or for the month. But on Clever, you always get the best of what is currently available in the market. So to withdraw your money, first, if you are using a brand new account, you need to come over to recipient and then click add new recipient then add the bank account you want to withdraw to so you can select the country nigeria select your bank and then go ahead enter the account number and then click on save i already have the account i want to use so i'll come over to transfers and then click on make transfer you can also do it from here if you come over to accounts click on transfer and then it will bring you over to this same section then you select the recipient, select one of the accounts you've added to recipient. Then the amount you want to send, let me say $60. And then for this, I'll get 87,900 Naira. That's at the rate of 1,465 Naira for $1. And you can see they are not charging you any transfer fee. This can really help you save a lot of money. Then you can enter a description if you want, but it's optional, so I'll just click continue. All right, this is a summary of the transaction you're about to make. Um, there's a bank account that the money will be sent to and um, all of that. So I'll just click on confirm details. You enter your Clever PIN. That's the PIN you created when setting up your Clever account. Then I'll just click submit. All right, your transfer is now in transit. We will send it 7,900 and all of that. Usually the transfer happens instantly. Let me check. And the money is already here inside my bank account. So that's how easy it is to withdraw from Clever to your Nigerian bank account. So anytime you receive money from anywhere, maybe from your client, Upwork, you know, Pioneer, you can even use Wise, Amazon KDP, wherever you need to receive dollar payments from, you can use your Clever USD account to do that. And since I started using Clever Banking, I've not had any issues with them. And I've been using them for months now. And just in case, if you need any help, you can always contact their customer support and they'll quickly help you out. I'm going to leave their Twitter handle in the description. So if you need to reach out to them, maybe you can contact them on Twitter or wherever you prefer. You can even connect your Clever account to PayPal and that'll make it easy for you to withdraw your money from PayPal to your Clever account and then proceed to withdraw it to your Nigerian bank account. Let me even show you how to link your Clever account to your PayPal account. Just open your PayPal account and then come over to account settings. Here, click on money, banks, and cards. Then you will see the option to link a bank. Just click on it. Remember, my bank name here on Clever is Wells Fargo. So I'm going to select Wells Fargo. There are two ways to connect your bank with PayPal. You can either log in and then it will connect automatically or you can just enter the details manually. And it's a manual method that we're going to use. So click here where you have link your bank another way. Account type is checking. You know, we're using business checking here. Then the routing number, I'm going to copy my routing number. Please it, copy, and then come over and paste. Also copy the account number. So here is it, copy it, and then paste it right here. For the account name, I'm going to select pass now. This is the name on my Clever USD account. And then after entering all of these details, you can just go ahead and click authorize and link, then proceed with the remaining steps. Basically, PayPal is going to send two small amounts of money to your Clever account, and then you're going to get the code to verify you know, your bank account from the transaction description. And once you have everything linked up, you can start withdrawing money from your PayPal account to your Clever account whenever you want. Another cool thing you can do on Clever is to get a virtual dollar card that you can use to make all your dollar payments online. So if I come over here to cards, here you can easily create a virtual dollar card that you can use to pay for stuff online. Maybe your subscriptions or you need to buy anything in dollars. 
um, this card is going to work and I've also been using this for a while now. The way this works is you can top up your card using the money you receive into your USD account. And then from there, you can go ahead and use it to do whatever you want to do. So that's basically it for this video, guys. I hope you got value from this video. And if you have any questions, just drop them in the comment section. I'll be there answering your questions. And before you go, don't forget to like if this video helps you. Also subscribe and ring the bell so that you'll be the first to know whenever I drop a new video like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.